I'm Megan and this is Marie. We're from the Vermont Institute of Natural Science and today we have a really small patient that we're going to release. It's a ruby-throated hummingbird who came into our care, was unable to fly, and um, we actually found that he had a bunch of spider web in his wing. And so we were able to remove that and we gave him some nectar to get some calories into him and now he's ready to go. So we're going to release this little guy. It'll probably be hard to see him go, but um, we want to get him out as soon as we can. It's going to take a little minute to acclimate. Take in his surroundings. <laughs> you can see just how tiny he is. And this is a male ruby throated hummingbird. There he goes. Good luck, little buddy. Oh my. <laughs> it's like a bubble. This is another ruby throated hummingbird patient we have here at Vins uh, who is not ready to be released. He actually has a fracture in one of his wings, so he has a little body wrap on. And right now he is drinking nectar out of a syringe and it's kind of hard to see um, exactly what's going on, but he has the tip of his beak inside the syringe and his tongue is lapping up the nectar that is in there. And we feed him every hour. Hi, I'm Megan from the Vermont Institute of Natural Science. What you have just seen is one example of the more than 400 birds that Vince cares for each year. As a 501c3 not-for-profit organization, we depend on your support to provide the medical treatment these birds require to get them healthy and back into the wild. In addition to our on-site avian rehabilitation facility, the Vins Nature Center in Queechy, Vermont proudly displays an impressive collection of live raptors, songbirds, and other animals for you to see up close. With 47 acres of diverse natural habitat, the Vins Nature Center offers a host of educational programs and special events enjoyable for people of all ages. For the latest information on the birds in our care, a list of our current Nature Center programs, outreach opportunities, and events, or to contribute to Vins so that we can continue our important work, please visit our website at vinsweb.org or call 802-359-5000 for more information.